There's nothing like being outside in front of the chicken coop, working in the garden, dressing up the front of their coop, making it pretty and letting them forage outside when a big split-tailed kite the size of a huge hawk decides to try to dive bomb you. Thank you, Jesus. I was able to get all the babies inside without any problems. But I didn't get to finish my garden. Let me show you. See, I was trying to plant herbs. The lemongrass wasn't doing real good, but it's still alive. And the um, citronella plant managed to stay alive for me. Planted some mint in between, and that's gonna take off. I put two little baby cherry tomatoes out here. I have plenty growing in my garden, and they won't eat the leaves, but when the fruit ripens, they'll love the fruit. And then periwinkles, I planted another branch of those. And I was working on putting this big old asparagus per fern in the ground when it decided to come after us. But they're inside. They're foraging with their scratch that I gave them right now. So they're okay. But oh boy, was that scary or what? So they're nice and safe eating their scratch. 14 out here. And one going broody in here. Though there's five nice boxes for her to choose she wants to lay in the corner of the coop i decided to leave her there if she's still there tomorrow i'll pick her up and move her and see if there's any eggs underneath her in the meantime there's eggs back there waiting on me so i'm going to go around back and collect some eggs i have two eggs there five eggs there one egg there, one egg there, and one egg there. That's an anomaly. They don't ever, and I mean ever, use all five boxes. So, usually they fight for one or two. Let me get my eggs out. See you in a minute. I still have yet to bury that asparagus fern. And then, I have a big foxtail fern over here that needs my help. It's got clovers growing out of it, but I think I'm going to leave that one in the pot. Just clean it up a bit. And there's broken bricks everywhere. I need to pick those up. There's broken sticks everywhere. I need to pick those up. So I will do a refresh probably in the next couple of days. Well, that's it with the chicken coop update for now. We did end up losing the one white girl that was on the mend. I don't want to go into details. It was now fun. And my husband took care of it. Thank you, Jesus. But we have 15 good, strong, healthy chickens. And they seem to love it out here. Actually, matter of fact, I have a hard time getting them to come out of their house anymore. Not because they're afraid of birds, but they just like their house. They got enough room, they got enough food. And I think they prefer the scratch over the bugs. <laughs> Either way, um, I'll probably be down here in the next couple of days cleaning the rest of this up. I would like very much to paint this thing soon. Give it some a fresh look. Make it feel better. And I would like to put a few more pots of flowers around here too. But in the meantime, that's it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a blessed day.